complex backgrounds can be used in a top-down RPG game to bring a map or cutscene to life. And right now we have this grass above the cliff. And it kind of looks bland and like it's cutting into our quote-unquote cliff. So we need to fix that by removing the grass. I'm going to select Paint Tool, select a transparent tile, and remove. Now note that only the transparent tiles will show the parallax background. The second thing we need to do is go down to our map. We need to hit edit. We need to go down to the background section and choose an image. RPG Maker automatically gives you these to work with, but you could upload your own. Let's choose sunset and loop horizontally. And this horizontally or vertically is which way it's going to go. Is it going to go to the left? Is it going to go to the right? Or is it going to go up or down? and the scroll is the scroll speed and the higher number you put the faster it scrolls so I'm leaving it at 1 for now and already it looks so much better so the second thing we're gonna do to make it even better is we are going to grab some trees and you can tell that there's a sense of depth at it with the tree hanging over the cliff and now we'll grab some more trees right here put one right here and put one right here and that looks so much better automatically let's hit play and see it and just like that this looks so much better than what we had before the whole map looks more alive the whole scene feels more alive and if you had animals walking around or people walking around too the whole thing would just feel so alive you could put some calm music in there and bring the whole map to life. Anyways, this is Trick Ghoul. Thank you for watching and thank you for your support. Hit the like button so other people can see this information. Trick Ghoul, out.